Uh, what is going on guys, Marshall1 here and today finally I'm playing again with uh, Noviski but this time as I promised you long time before I will be playing with Noviski full custom uh, and I wanted to show you this video even earlier but I did ask you about I think 400 likes on my latest Scar Age video and I told you that I will do and reveal you something really nice so at the moment I'm playing on weekend thanks to my friend who allowed me as last time uh, when I did a video with Noviski but uh, I haven't done a face cam so today I've decided to do a face cam and show you how I'm playing uh, on weekend and of course again I'm playing hardcore and it's a little bit wild you know to play after a while and I already did few rounds and I'm getting a little bit confused you know because uh, so far I've been playing for weeks normal mode and haven't been on hardcore so everything looks so slow but I'm using a blitz camo if it's bothering you why it's looking so nice I'm using a uh, camper XL and 15 tactical device and Osprey silencer all this can be found in the last set or last meta level and I really have no idea when update gonna happen on Facebook congregate and other pages because you know developers are hard working on fixing hide ups and later I will do a compare oh come on sorry uh, wait later I will do a compare uh, about Hide ops and contract force, what are the bad things and negative, uh, I mean bad and positive, so you guys can compare and also I will do my review, is it really worth to give 10 dollars, oh I'm sorry, <laughs> double headshot, so that will be my review and I will really not lie to you but game is still in develop mode, it has a lot of bugs, but believe me it's worth to get. When I tell you this, I really mean it. I know people complain about hackers, but have in mind every game has a hackers. So I think this time it won't be a thank you. Uh, it won't be a problem to deal with them because Steam is another platform, and I believe a lot of you guys uh, never tried or seen what means Steam. Uh, simply there, you don't have to wait for developers. You can uh, record and send it to Steam, you can report whole profile on Steam and those guys from Steam will ban totally whole accounts so if he's hacking let's say in hide ops and he have 10 on other games he will be totally banned and that's the great option so I think it's the best punish for those hackers and if you ask me really uh, I know it's gonna sound rude but I will implement that punish for hacking so once you see it I believe you will never hack in future <laughs> but anyway let's go back to contract wars I must admit it's great to have fun and to to play again this game after a while and I must admit that Whiskey Silencer is really behaving so great. You see a visual recoil is not that high as it was at the start and in my first video about Novisky in my review I did told you that visual recoil is really increased and that this weapon was probably ruined by developers but uh, I guess this time is uh, pretty awesome if you want to hear my opinion I think uh, it's less bouncing than M4 and of course it's way less bouncing than uh, SA um, I'm sorry HK 417D and at the moment I think you guys have a feeling like I'm playing with SA 58 you know because visual recall is really really minimum with camper but as I said, every weapon with Kemper is so sexy and <coughs> I'm sorry 
I think this is gonna be a long round because those guys are camping and whiskey uh, really isn't for medium combat so you wanna fight in close distance or keep few meters between you and your enemy and um, for hardcore it's not really that that much effective you can play but um, well, you know what, I've got used to... Oh my god. Come on. Uh, I've got used to hardcore, but uh, I, I, I'm really having a problems striking on my enemy. It's good when you catch them from the back and they are not looking. So, uh, definitely I will recommend you to play on normal mode with no whiskey any map because it's much effective with uh, skills and if you even decide to play oh it's lagging oh we are p uh, if you even decide to play uh, hardcore then definitely go to maps like terminal 2 or evac come on if i had 417 this guy would be a long time ago dead Come on. So this is only my opinion and what I've seen so far because I really enjoy testing weapons on hardcore mode because it's so realistic and it's giving me a nice option to test guns how they behave without weapon skills. And wait, thank you. I was curious if this way IP is planning to die. So we are just on the half and it really looks like this is gonna be a long long match so if you're a fan of long videos on my channel I think it's a perfect time to grab popcorns and some coke and enjoying the rest because here what I'm doing I, I'm just flanking around moving searching for the enemies and they are camping and I know some guys will say like nice camp Marshall one and usually on videos you can hear that thing how they say it but obvious obvious you can see that I'm moving all the time. So far I stopped only once on the roof. So I think uh, in situations like this for me it's not boom fun to play because I, I hate camping games. Ouch, he got me. Oh, look at the screen, we are losing. So those guys are simply not planning to give up from camping. <sighs> I'm just dying way more often than I'm killing, <clears throat> so... Oh, nice. Someone wounded him before me. Uh, anyway, uh, yes, I wanted to tell you at the start of this video by completing uh, this video and doing a face cam with Novisky full custom. I did finish it. All weapons uh, in the latest update that happened for knives. Uh, that happened for Wiki. Sadly, I have to say it, it uh, never happened on Facebook on Congregate. I don't know will they update this game, but turn around and I think they will not because if they wanted to update this game, they will do it long time ago because it's been like a two months since update came on VK and those guys obviously got bored of all those weapons they unlocked everything so um, I've been thinking like maybe maybe developers are 
trying to fix something and next update if it ever happens uh, they will add new guns then they will update oh look at you both let's say they will add those weapons on Facebook and congregate of course and they will add a new one so I have no freaky idea will it happen it's only my opinion and what do I think because it's too late to update now and um, maybe they cannot update maybe something uh, will happen because there is a probably story behind this maybe it's sad to say but contract force will be closed because browsers will stop supporting it and I think um, there is a name of one browser I'm not really sure what's the name oh I'm sorry what's the name of it but I will try to figure out and I think that will be the only one working browser in the future on which you will be able to play contract force and I believe after developers uh, finish with Hideout project that they will go back here in contract force and revive it from that so I think it will continue to live if not you know everything is going to the end so you just have to deal with that games are there to be played and to move on after a while because Contract 4 is up over four years and usually it's like that just go back to any games you want many of them are closed so you simply have to deal with that you enjoy today because tomorrow probably you will have no chance so I hope you guys really had fun uh, at least watching me playing with Nobiski full custom as I said this time I finish all videos uh, from the latest update from VK too bad I couldn't record it on Facebook to show you guys but I hope at least you had a chance to see it uh, if I get new information about contract force I will make sure definitely to share with you guys so you can know what is happening and really you can come and stand next to me to pray for this game not to be closed down because so many players doesn't have good computers and they don't have a chance to play new games so I hope developers will have mercy to let those guys play this free game and enjoying it because I see a lot of players really enjoy so that's why I've decided to make another Contract Force video and I hope it's a nice for a change I said at the start I will not forget this game as long as it is living so you guys have no worry I will do all weapon reviews guides and other things by the time if they add something new if not I will go back through your comments see what weapons you wanna see me playing with and I will continue to play this sounds so sad but I really had to say it <laughs> but we will be playing another games and I hope you guys who been following me will continue to follow me in another videos I hope really to expand my channel to get new subscribers but you know they will never be like old one because I, I started with you guys you've been following me from the start and the Contra Force being a game who helped me to get out and reach those subscribers but anyway I hope you at least enjoy it. I'm saying this for the third time and you had a chance to see this Nobiski full custom so please support this video with like button and my content of course and if you haven't subscribed make sure to subscribe down there. Anyway thanks for watching and as always my comrades enjoy.